Iran has recently unveiled the newest version of its homegrown missile defense system Babar 373, which is said to have taken one step closer to the Russian-made S-400 anti-aircraft weapon system. During the test fire, a stationary target was detected at a range of more than 450 kilometers by the optimized radar of the missile system and was tracked at a range of about 405 kilometers and was hit at a range of more than 300 kilometers. The long-range missile has solid fuel. It was evaluated during operation for the first time. The detection radar range of the Babar 373 system has increased from 350 to 450 km, and its engagement radar range has increased from 260 to 400 km. The Babar 373 long-range air defense system is capable of detecting up to 100 targets, tracking 60 of them, and engaging with 6 concurrently. A distinguishing feature of Babar 373 is its vertical launching system with square launchers, mostly used for air defense on warships. The system's missile range has increased from 200 to 300 km, and its engagement altitude has increased from 27 to 32 km. The Babar air defense system employs three different types of missiles to hit targets at various altitudes. It has been able to hit targets just five minutes after fire, at an altitude of 43,000 feet. Meanwhile, according to unverified reports by an Ascent Twitter handle, at Pataramesh, the tests seem to have used HES Akarar targeting drones for the long-range Sayyad B-4 missiles to shoot down. The radar cross-section, RCS, of Akarar drone is known to be 1.64 meters square, and at Pataramesh reported in a Twitter thread that during the tests, the X-band engagement radar used by the system was able to get a lock onto the target at a range of 376 km. It was also reported that the missile's maximum altitude increased from 27 to 32 km. Iran's Thasneem News Agency quoted the Islamic Republic of Iran Air Defense Force, IRIF, commander. Brigadier General Ali Reza Sabahifard, saying that a target drone was destroyed at an altitude of 40,000 feet 12.2 kilometers. At Pataramesh also claimed that if the RCS of the Karar drone and the performance of this X-band radar against it is taken as a reference for comparison with the F-35, which has an RCS of 0.0015 to 0.005 meters squares. The Babar 373 could engage the American 5th Gen stealth aircraft at around 90 kilometers. However, at Pataramesh notes that these performance parameters would hold only for the missiles guided by semi-active radar homing, SARH, or the seeker-aided ground guidance, SAG. The SARH-SAG are a common type of missile guidance system that relies on a passive sensor of radar signals inside the nose of the missiles, which picks up the radar signals provided by an external source as it reflects off the target. Regarding frequency, stealth fighters are known to be stealthiest in X-band and S-band, and therefore experts doubt the claims made by Atpataramesh. I would imagine X-band radar was one of the key radar threats that the F-22S and F-35S engineers had in mind when they designed both aircraft.
Thomas Withington, an expert on electronic warfare, radar, and military communications, told the Eurasian Times. Withington further raised some questions, saying, assuming the radar could maintain lock, could it still do this when the aircraft is using onboard and offboard countermeasures to jam the radar? Following radar evading flight profiles and being targeted by anti-radar missiles. President Hassan Rouhani also boasted the production of the advanced missile system, saying the mobile missile defense system is more powerful than S-300 missile system and is more like S-400. This very valuable work is a great present of the armed forces and defense ministry for the Iranian people, Rouhani said during the unveiling ceremony. Bob R 373 is a mobile missile defense system designed to intercept and destroy incoming hostile targets. The system employs missiles that have a maximum range of 300 kilometers. The system is capable of simultaneously detecting up to 300 targets, tracking 60 targets at once and engaging 6 targets at a time, according to Press TV. The system is a competitor to Russia's S-300 missile system and brings quite a few substantial upgrades over its Russian equivalent. Brigadier General Abbas Farajpour, head of the Iranian Air Force Studies Center, said on Thursday that the system was named Babar, Faith. Because the Iranians are confident that they are able to build a system which turns the country into a regional and international power. At a juncture, the country which builds S-300 Russia lost its willingness to deliver the missile system to us. So, we came to the conclusion that sometimes even our friends do not want or are not be able to help us. The first spark struck and we took action to manufacture a domestic system which is more sophisticated, he explained.